San Diego Mayor Todd Gloria is joining mayors from across the state to focus on mental health and homelessness. Gloria and other leaders are pushing for a bill that could detain people with addictions who refuse to get help and send them to treatment. CBS 8's Regina Yurita shows us what the bill would do and how disability rights advocates are responding tonight. The bill is the latest attempt to update California's 56 year old law governing mental health conservatorship. Leaders say a stricter approach is needed to get treatment to people who are living on the streets suffering with addiction, but those who are opposed say it's unconstitutional. Soon people in California could be detained against their will because of a mental illness. Mayors from the state's largest cities, including Mayor Todd Gloria, were in Sacramento today supporting a bill that could allow that to happen. Our current rules are absolutely do not make any sense, right? When I'm often asked, Mayor, why aren't you doing something about this person who is screaming at the top of the lungs on the street corner? And I say, well, they're not a threat to themselves or to others. That rings hollow. Current state law allows courts to order people into treatment, but only if they're in danger to themselves or others. This new bill plans to expand that and include people who suffer from mental illness or addiction and refuse to get help. Today, Mayor Todd Gloria talked about his support for the bill and how it could save lives. What happens to those folks is all across this state, which are folks living unsheltered in extremely dangerous situations, uh, where too often the end result is their death. According to Gloria, of the thousands of emergency calls at San Diego County, first responders respond to daily 400 are related to behavioral issues. I know that we our current rules sets the bar so high that we can't help that individual. While leaders believe this could save unsheltered lives and even reduce homelessness, advocacy groups who focus on disability rights oppose the law. They say it could lead to locking more people up against their will and depriving them of fundamental rights including privacy and liberty. Advocates also say leaders should be investing on improving mental health services. The bill has only been introduced. Regina Urita, CBS 8.